William, always on time. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Be very welcome to the final class of the week. Yes. Today is the final class for this week. Yeah, correct. Imagine final class in the week number three. We are close to finish the course, pretty close to finish this course. Okay, let's see. Let's begin uh, with you, William. Uh, the rest of your classmates can join in the next minutes, but we okay. have to begin with the class. Let's see. Uh, let me know, please, if you see the the screen of my computer. Yes, I see. I see your desktop. Okay, perfect, perfect, very good. Okay, William, how was how was your day today? Was it busy as always? Did you relax a little bit, if you could? Uh, I was busy in my work but it's very good because the time uh every time is is faster ah, okay okay pretty good but, yes every time or you can say the time goes faster or goes goes by or oh. Bye, ahí va. Or goes faster. Yes, that is correct. Okay. Uh, today is... Today is... Thursday. Thurs, Thursday. November. November. And the date... Today is 16th. It's the 16th. Okay, we are close to Christmas. We are close 14 days for December. Imagine the last month of the year. Okay, let's see. Ah, there is Gabriel online. Hello, Gabriel. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. I'm hey, here. what's going on with the accident? I saw the message. Yeah, yeah. Um, I know that um, that was a, a sorry, I, I'm thinking to, to say um, <laughs> No problem. A, a song uh, that uh, somewhat little a uh, little bit close with me. Um, he had the accident with someone that was uh, very uh, very happy or very mm. um uh ebrio how do you say uh, drunk John, yeah drunk. Uh, then with the, when he crashed with uh, a van he he went to crash with a poster of energy so they cause a shutdown of the energy here Oh, okay. It sounds kind of complicated, that accident. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. Wow. Imagine if you are on the on the sidewalk. In La Cera, sidewalk is a Cera. If you are in the sidewalk and that happens, I, I don't want to imagine. It's yeah, pretty yeah. dangerous. Yeah, of course. Right? Yeah, imagine. What happened in, in that moment? Wow. It was a drunk, a drunk uh, man. Yeah. 
Oh, wow, incredible. You have to be careful, guys. Uh, if you drive, if you don't drive, doesn't matter. Be careful, depending everywhere what's going on on your surroundings. Lo que pasa en sus, en sus? Mm -hmm. Alrededores. Yes, correct. In your surroundings, the spelling surroundings. Okay, okay, pretty good. New words. Okay, guys, uh, welcome. Today we have the final class, class number 12, because we finished the week number three. Let me remind you to finish with the assignments in the platform or you have access to your diploma already? You have access to it, to the diploma? I have. Ah, you received it already? Yeah. Nice, that's great. Uh, what about you, William and, and Carlos? Have you received it? Mm, I... Not yet, uh, um, I'm not finished. Uh... Ah, okay, all only, right. Only, only the lesson of the week four. Okay, okay, no problem. Continue, guys. We have, we have more than a week. The next week, the four days, and you have the weekend to advance in your assignments. Okay, let's see. Today, we are going to practice about this topic. William, can you read it? modifiers, participles, and prepositions. Okay, I'm going to show you how to use them. Don't, is, don't be scared about what is a modifier, what is a participle, preposition, no idea, don't worry. Only take on account that these forms, we use them with? Nouns. With nouns. I, in I, in ING form. Okay. What is what is the ING form of drink, for example? What is drink. the ING form for drink? Drinking. drinking. Correct. Drinking. This is the ING form. Simple. Only ING. What is the noun of drink? What is the noun of drink? Noun? The noun, not ah. the verb. Okay. No. The noun, yes. Drink is a verb. Correct. And is it a noun as well? Is it a noun? Drink? For example, in a restaurant. Uh, good evening. Would you like any drink? Would you like any drink? Would you like tea? Would you like soda? Um, coffee, maybe. So, drink can be a noun as well. It works as a noun, not only as a verb. Okay, let's check this. Question, do you know that guy? Do you know this guy? <laughs> he is Johnny Depp. That's it. Correct. He is Johnny Depp. He is Johnny Depp. Pretty good. What's, What's his, his profession? What profession. profession? What's his profession? He is actor. He's an he actor. Is an, an actor. Correct. Pretty good. We are going good with those two first questions. Next, in the picture. Okay, imagine you have no idea about Johnny Depp. You don't know Johnny Depp. You haven't seen him. Who is Johnny Depp? Can you read this? How do we, How do we, How do we emphasize, emphasize, emphasize who is the, who person? Is the person? We talk about. We talk about. We talk about. Okay. Imagine 
We don't know Johnny Depp. We have no idea. Please, how can you tell me what person in the picture is Johnny Depp? How can you say who is Johnny Depp in the picture? It's in the middle of the woman and the man. Ah, okay. With, with a, uh, I don't remember the, with the colita, I don't remember the. Ah, with the ponytail. Ponytail, right. Ah, that's right. Very good. I, in the first part, you mentioned something important. You said in the middle. In the middle is a preposition of place. Very good. So you emphasize that Johnny Teacher, Johnny Depp is the man who is in the middle of this guy and the woman, or Johnny Depp is the guy using with the uh, or with, correct? With the Ponytail. 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 Correct. Very and good. wearing wearing glasses. You can use everything. What do you see in the picture? Ah, Johnny Depp. He's wearing glass. glasses. He's wearing glasses. Ah, uh, what is this? A daily, maybe. Or you can say, has, ah, Johnny Depp is is the man. Who, who has? Who has a cell phone on, on the hand? Or uh, carrying, uh, carrying a cell phone? I, I, I see a, a iPhone. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. Okay, but below or under the cell phone, what is he carrying? Okay, what is go. the other object? Uh-huh, yeah, neither me. Neither me. Good eye. Good eye. Buen ojo. Uh -huh. What besides that? Besides the cell phone, what is this? What is this object? I um, I can is um... newspaper, maybe, right? Yeah. Newspaper. Okay, could be. It's a newspaper, all right. Okay, pretty good. Or you can say, ah, it's uh, Johnny Depp is the actor. Check the actor. Uh, using what is this? This garment? Mm -hmm. huh? so, uh, it's a uh, tie. 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 Correct. Tie. Very good. Ah, correct. That's it. Nice, nice. Okay. Now you have an idea about how to emphasize when talking about specific things using prepositions of place in this case. But let me show you. You can use the participle. Let's we'll talk about this. In which form? Let me show you. What is a participle? Check a below. A participle is used before, before a noun. Okay. Keep, keep in mind that. That a participle goes before the noun what is the question if people ask you hey who is who is johnny depp who is johnny depp the noun that you can use can be he's the man or second option he's the one he's the one what is what is the meaning of he's the one what does it mean what does he mean? He's the one. El es... No, no. El es... Eh, ajá. El es el, el que, in this case. Ah, el es el que. Is... Es el único. único. It, means, it means that. Significa eso. But in this context, you say that he's the one that is... Ah, es el que. Someone specific. Doing something specific. Ah, is the one shooting shooting at you. 
but no ing. In this case, you are going to use a participle in the form of the ing. So you can say, who is Johnny Depp, guys? Who is Johnny Depp? Is the the man or wearing white glasses? Wearing white glasses, or you can say, he's the one wearing white glasses, or only white white glasses. That's it. What about this? About his clothes. He is the one. Okay, but use, remember, what is a participle ing form of the verb? ing, participle. He is the one, what is the participle of use? Using. Using. Ah, he is the one using Using? Using. Oh. Ah, blue. blue. Un traje azul. In English? Traje. Blue suit. A blue suit. That's it. Okay, pretty good. So, in this example, you can use participles to be a specific about someone but remember participle is used with with what with noun with nouns the man is a noun el hombre the man or the one el que in this case let's check another example uh, uh be before that can you read it in this case mm -hmm. In this case, the ing form is a modifier, equal adjective. It's like an adjective. It's similar to an adjective, wearing. What is he wearing? White, White glasses. glasses. White glasses. What is he using? A blue suit. A blue suit. suit. The pronunciation suit. is suit. suit. We don't pronounce the, the letter I. Mm -hmm. suit. suit. Yeah, it's suit. Okay, but this is not, not, not an not ing verb. verb. Why not? Por qué no es ing verb? Do you see the verb to be? Do you see verb to be? Mm. He is using. Do you see he is because using? He is before uh, the noun. Correct. Because the participle is after it would be. Sería después. Let me correct that. Let me make the correction. Is after, after the noun. That's it. First is the noun and after the noun is the participle ing. You can use any, any participle ing. Example, next. Who is Will Smith? How can you tell me which of those people is Will Smith? Using a noun. Okay, first is a noun, imagine. Who is he? Check. The WH question can be number one. Who is Will Smith? Who is Will Smith or? Who is who he? Is who he? is he? Okay. How can you tell me who is Will Smith? You have some options. The nouns are. What are the nouns? He's, he's the actor. He's the actor. Number one. Number two. Now he's number two. He is it's the, the one. one. Now number three that you can use to specify about Will Smith. He is a single rapper. Not anymore, but he used to sing. 
Ya no, pero solía cantar. Yes. But you can use it as a reference. Okay. Now, number four that you can use. He's the man. He's the man. Or. He's the person. He's the person. Is, can you find any other noun? Puede encontrar otro, otro noun? Que no sea estos? Can you find any other? No? Is. Ajá. Ah. Ah. No? Okay. No problem. Next, after the noun, it goes by el participle. participle. Example, who is Will Smith? He's the actor. He's the actor. Holding on Oscar. Holding, what is holding? Sosteniendo, levantando. Yeah, correct, uh -huh. Sosteniendo, yes. Uh, who is Will Smith? Who is Will Smith? Choose any option. Cualquier option. You can read it. You can read it, guys. No problem. He's the man smiling more. Ah, he is the man who is. Who is? You can add who is. Le puedo agregar ahí who is. Ah, he is the man who, who is. is smiling. He's more. smiling more. In the picture, yes, it's clear. Very good. He's smiling more. That's it. What else? Who is who is Jaden Smith? Who is Jaden Will Smith son? Okay, we are not talking about Will Smith anymore. We are talking about Jaden Smith, the son. Who is Jaden Smith? He's the youngest boy wearing an orange suit. Very good. That's it. Ah, Jaden Smith. He's. Can you repeat it? Repeat it again, please. He's the youngest boy. The youngest, uh -huh, the youngest boy. Wearing. Correct. Wearing. Orange suit. And because. And orange. Uh -huh. And orange suit. suit. Okay, very good. Nice. What is the noun? The youngest boy is the noun. What is the participle ing that goes after? Is wearing. Wearing. That's it. Any other option with uh, Jaden Smith? Is there any other option for a noun? Yes, yes. Uh, let's see, Carlos, William. Mm, Use Smith. noun. First, first part is using a noun. No, Jaden Smith. You cannot use. Yes. He's the youngest boy. You cannot use it. Use another noun, a different noun. He's the. He's the boy. Okay. Check the hair. What is the the hair? The it's type the of hair. It's the hair. It's the curly hair. Ah, very good. He's. He's the boy. He's. The, the boy. curly. Curly the one. The curly one. Is mm. this a nice a noun, guys? Is this a noun? Yes or no? Yes, it's a noun. Yes, it's a noun. I am saying, estoy diciendo. Ah, él es él. ¿El qué? Um, ¿Ah? Chico Cabello. Uh, what, is, what is this? What is Corley? ¿Qué es Corley? Colocho. El Colocho, so... yes. 
Will Smith is not courtly. The other two girls are not courtly. And this so guy the, is a little courtly. The second one? Courtly. All right. Yes, it's a little courtly, but you are being specific. Ah, it's the courtly one. Now use the ing. Which ing? Not wearing. Uh -huh. Ya no puedo usar wearing. Use another ing. Verbs, think in a verb. Verbs, what verbs teacher? I cannot see verbs about Using. Him. Using is another option, yes? Using. Ah, que está usando un peinado bien feo. Puedo decir eso. Ajá. Uh -huh. Using. A very ugly hair, hair, haircut. Haircut, correct. Check. Noun. Ing. That's it. Got it. Got it, guys. Got it. Se entiende? Yes. Check. Holding. Wearing. What else? Will Smith? Who is Will Smith? Ah, he's the man. ING. Posing for a photograph. Correct. Smiling more or standing in the middle of the other four people. Correct. Okay. What else? What else is next? Check. That is the order. Next, next. Uh -huh. Who is who is Don Ramon? Let's see. Uh, William, can you try one sentence? Who is Don Ramon? Don Ramon is the person Correct. With, with a mustache. Okay. And with wearing, a mustache. With a, Ah, but he you has. have to use the ing. Uh, ing uh -huh. before. Repeat it, repeat it. Ramon is the person has a mustache. He tiene bigot. Having a. Ah, but we cannot say the having. Or, or yes. Has. Tiene. But has is not ing. But has in... So. In... Have with ing. Have with ing is having. Having. Ajá. Ah, Ramón iba a decir que Don Ramón es la persona que tiene el bigote y está usando camisa celeste. Ah, in English. <laughs> Ajá, in English. We are learning to say that. Eso estamos aprendiendo. A decir. Sí, sí. Okay. Don uh, Ramón is the person uh, he has. A mustache and wearing a, a blue light shirt. Shirt, sure. okay. But in the sentence, you don't need to say he has. No okay. necesita decir okay. he has. Only no. ing forms, ing. Don okay. Ramon is the person uh, having a mustache using... Oh. A light blue shirt, um, posing for a photograph. What else? What else with ing? Mm -hmm. Gabriel, mm -hmm. Carlos, mm -hmm. standing mm -hmm. back of uh, a child lodge. Ah, okay, that's another option. Yes, the Ramon is only the person. Can you use any other noun? What was uh, Don Ramon's profession? What was his profession? Actor. Actor. Ah, so you can say Don Ramon. He's, uh, he's, he's the actor. The actor, correct. The actor 
is standing behind, correct? Behind the chavo. That's it. All right, very good. And who is uh, this character? Do you remember the name of the character? The Kiko. Ah, who is Kiko? Uh huh. Who is Kiko in the picture? Noun, pink, cool. noun, noun. Was was Kiko an adult in the program? Was he an adult? Was he? Was he an adult? An adulto, Kiko in the in the program? No, uh, well, no, child. right? Ah, he is. He is okay. Begin with that. Ahí comienza. Who is Kiko? Who is the child? Kiko is the child, correct? Now the ING. Ahora va la ING. Who is the child? Kiko is the child. Holding a balloon. Holding a... Ah, okay, a balloon. Balloon, globo. Well, balloon, pelota. Uh -huh. balloon. Okay. Yeah, balloon, whatever. Okay, pretty good. That's it. Okay, no problem, guys. Check. You have options about Don Ramon. He's? He's Don Ramon. He's Don Ramon. But in this one, number one is not kind of correct. He's Don Ramon wearing a hat. Um, yeah, maybe yes. Okay. But specific nouns are? He's? He's the comedian. He's the comedian. ING options. You have many, many options. Looking at, at to another camera. Uh, is that true? Ah, uh, because the picture was taken in, in a camera that was in front, but they three were looking at at the other, at the other side, correct. Looking at to another camera, uh, Don Ramon is the one is standing behind the chavo, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Check. You have several options according with the picture or with the situation that you have. Okay. Questions? Questions about this form? Participles? Is that clear? Clear, clear, guys? If not, we continue with, with the next part. No questions, no questions. Okay, good. Let's see with this part. We can make similar sentences, but not using ING forms. In this opportunity, we are going to use prepositions. Let's check. Who are they, guys? Who are they? They are they are musicians. Ah, they are musicians, correct. That's it. What else? What else? What else? What what is that band specifically? No. What is that band? I don't know what is the band. Look at the look at the picture. Look at the scenario. Mm -hmm. What color is the picture? What is the predominant color in the picture? Blue. Blue, correct. So that is the clue. Ahí está la pista. Blue. <laughs> mm. Uh huh. Second clue. Cumbias. Oh. Este. Los, ah, uh, los. Ajá, los. You are close, you are close. Está cerca. Ah, los. Los ángeles azules son bajos. They are, correct, they are. Pretty good. Okay, nice. Guys, in this case, who are los ángeles azules? Who are los ángeles azules? Why, who are, porque who are? Why? Because they are uh, a lot of on the band. They are 
many musicians. Many. Correct. Many musicians. musicians is plural. That's why. Correct. Very good. Who are the who are Los Angeles students? Noun. Example. They are the band. They are the band. Or they the ones. They are the ones. Or what you said before, lo que dijo antes. They are the musicians. the musicians, correct, correct. But now, no ing. Now use prepositions. Examples? On a stage. On a stage. They are the, they band. the band on a stage. On, on a stage. stage. What is the preposition on? What is on? on the Sobre el escenario, yes. Correct. Because they are standing there. Ahí están parados. Yes? Nice. Ah, another. They are the ones on on the stage. In his, on a stage. Can you use uh, any other preposition? ¿Se puede usar otra preposition? Yes or no? Another example with with a picture. Huh? Check, check, check. Okay, give me one example with with a noun and with a preposition. Check. You have two plus musician is three, but Think in another preposition. Ideas, ideas. Yes, guys, Gabriel, William, Carlos. At. No. About complete. Who are Los Angeles Azules? They are of the scenario. They are at of the scenario, no. They are, but the noun, you need the noun always. Siempre necesita el noun. Oh, they are the band. They are the band. Now the preposition. Y ahora la preposition. At. At. At, can you use at? at? At the, at the scenario. scenario. At the scenario, yes, that the is scenario. one option. Another option that you can use? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is this? Yeah. Proposition. Mm -hmm. What am I doing? Proposition? Play, play. No. no, 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 I'm not playing. Mm -hmm. If we put playing, okay. is the band playing at the scenario? Not playing, remember. It is not playing because in this part, you need to mention what? The position. Not ING. ING were the previous ones. But is it, is, it yes. we put, yes. if we put uh, no at the, uh, the, 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 uh, the IA, uh, no sería, porque si lo ponemos como verbo y no como, um, se me olvidó. Uh, IG, uh, participle. Ajá, o sea, it, it, we don't use as a participle. But we use as a bear because yeah. they are um, playing music, right? Yeah, correct. They are playing music, but we are focusing on yeah, at the preposition on prepositions. All right. So this this example is correct, guys. Nice. Is they it? Are in, they are the bank in front. Correct. Of the public. Correct. Very good. That is another option. 
Ah, they are the band in front of. of. Nice, because in front of is another preposition of place. In front of the, the public. The public, correct. So you have option number two. Guys, question. Is at preposition yes or no? Yes, preposition. Check. For Let's the, check it out. For ah, at is preposition. preposition. Is in front of preposition. Sure. Is it? Well, no. Ah, come on, come on. Sometimes this dictionary gives issues. I don't know why. But yes, in front of is another preposition of place. Well, no. Yes. Well, no. Okay. Is there any other option with preposition? In. In, correct. That's it. They the, are, who is, who are the Los Angeles Azules? Who are the Los Angeles Azules? Who are the band? They are. They, they are. They are the, the band. In the. In. In the. In, Oh, what is this? Place. What is this? A meeting, a class. Mm. What is this? Meeting? No. A concert. No. Concert, of course. Music, concert, lights, scenario. Perfect. Very good. Ah, they are the band. The band. In the? In the concert. In the concert. Okay, very good, guys. You're getting it. So you can mention specific things using number one, ING forms. And that means participles. Or you can use prepositions. prepositions. Yes. To speak about specific things. Okay, pretty good. Let's check the number three. Number three is, okay, this is another example, but no problem. Check, who is, who is the rock? Who is he? Nouns? He's the actor. Or? He's the one. The bald one. He's the bald one. 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 Uh -huh. bald. No hair. What is what are you telling there? Que está diciendo ahí with he is the bold one. Calvo. Él es el calvo, yes. Do you see any calvo. other bold person? Ve otro calvo? Do you no. see any other? No. no. He is the only one. No, no, no. Único ahí. Rapado en el poste. Correct. <laughs> yes. So you don't lose. If you are specific People don't lose. Si usted es específico, la persona no se pierde. Okay. Uh, with prepositions, examples. The red carpet. On the red, are they on the red carpet? Main, maybe yes. Even if you don't see the, the red carpet, but they are like in a movie or something else. What else? Any other preposition? Next to the car. Or next to the womb. Correct. Next to. Okay, check. No ing. In this case, no ing. Only prepositions. Or. In front of the poster. In front of the poster. In front of the poster. Correct. What poster? This poster. On the wall. Okay. Okay, perfect. Let's check. Next part. Ah, okay, with objects, not only with people. Uh, guys, how can you tell me the place of the red horse? Where is the red horse? 
in the red purse is between the purse, the, the pink purse and black purse. Okay, pretty good. That's one option. Another option? Is the big one and the oh. other me. Uh-huh. Uh, in the middle of the black one and I I don't know what is the color of the, the other one. And the uh, pale pale rose is the name. Pale rose, rosa pallido. It's not completely pink. It's yeah, pale, yeah. pale rose. Pale. pale. You you write it pale. Lo pone como pale, pero it's pale, pale rose. Ah, correct. One option between. Second option in the middle of. Option three. It's next to. It's next or oh, it's next to the the black horse. Ah, yeah. okay, very good. Next to it's another preposition, but you're telling me to focus on the black, on the black horse. Very good. It's next to. Ah, Gabriel, you said it's the big one. Ah, okay, correct. It's the big one. In the or or, or it the, the poor that that has a number not in a, it don't choose a preposition but right. mm -hmm. the purse ha, has a uh como sería cordones a cordon okay yes you can say that but remember always mention prepositions yeah, for yeah. the pictures. Uh, what about this, using these pores? Where is the red pores? It's on. It's not on. On is this. When you touch. No, on is when the object touches a surface. But the red pores is not touching the other pores. So is. It's on the top. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, of the striped pores. Ah, okay, very good. The red pores is on the top of the striped, striped pores. pores. Correct. On the top is another preposition of place. Very good. Another one might be uh above you can use above as well se puede usar above ahí. yes very good okay options the red force or the red one the red one is between it's the between uh -huh. as between. you said como dijo yes yeah. next to it's next to the beige one Next the beige, beige one, one supposedly is is this one, but it's a pale rose, or about the striped the striped one. 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 Ah, está sobre la rayada. Very good. Okay, nice guys, nice, very nice, pretty good. Okay, uh, that was the topic. Guys, no more content. Let's check. And no more content, no slides. That's it. Okay, this is only to practice about these structures. We study about the participles using uh, modifiers, participles, and prepositions. Okay, guys, thank you for joining. Don't forget completing the exercises in the platform so you can obtain your certificate at the end. See you next week. Happy weekend. See you on Monday for the final week 
of the course, pre-intermediate module two. See you guys. Thank you for joining to the class. Appreciate that. Bye, teacher. Thank you. Bye-bye, sure. bye, guys. Okay. Have a nice weekend as well. You too, guys. Okay. See you. Bye. Bye-bye.